shall see the basics of arrays in C++. To understand the basics, we shall write a simple program to get array elements from the user and to find the sum of all the array elements. Array is a homogeneous set of elements, homogeneous data item. So it means uh, if A is declared as int, we need to input only integer variables as its elements and it will be stored from the index 0. If we take A of 5, it will be stored in A of 0, A of 1, A of 2, A of 3 and A of 4. 0 through 4 that is 5 elements. Declaration as well as initialization can be done in this way. Inside flower brackets we need to give the elements or else we can take it from the user from the keyboard. So let's see how to do that. First ask the user to input 5 integer elements. using a simple for loop i starts from 0 since the index is from 0 through 4 not 5 we'll take i less than 5 less than 5 means 4 0 through 4 which is 5 now we will ask the user to input okay a of 0 a of 1, 2, 3 and 4. Let's display the input array elements using another for loop. ENDL is a manipulator to get the new line. We shall find the sum inside this loop. Sum is equal to sum plus i, a of i. That is the value of a of i. Or we can even write sum plus equals a of i which is shortened notation of this sum is equal to sum plus a of i. Both work similarly. Now output the result. Sum of array elements is sum. And that's it. Save the file. Compile and run it. One, two, one, four, ten, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Okay. Let's do it again. This time we'll give all ones. We should give five. Okay, now we shall give one, two, three, four, five. We should give fifteen. Okay, it's working cool. Just remember the syntax of arrays and how to initialize and declare at the same time. Thanks for watching. Please share this video on Facebook and like it on YouTube. Thanks for watching.